Hello, friends. Welcome to Teddy Bear. Rise and shine and give God the glory, glory. Rise and shine and give God the glory, glory. Rise and shine and give God the glory, glory. Children of the Lord. Good morning, everyone. I am so glad that you are here joining us today. Let's start with a prayer. Put your hands together, bow your head, and close your eyes. Thank you, God, that we can gather together to hear your stories. Thank you for loving us so much that you sent your only son, Jesus, to save us so we can be your children forever. Amen. This Sunday is the first Advent. Do you know what Advent means? Advent means coming. What is coming? Who is coming? Long ago, God made a wonderful and exciting promise to the world. Someday, he would send his only son to the earth. His name would be Jesus Christ. Hundreds of years before Jesus was born, God promised he would come. God used a special way to tell the world about this wonderful promise. How do you think he told the world? <laughs> Over the phone? On a television? Or by email? No such things were not invented yet. God told man, who wrote down what they heard from God. That is called Bible. B-I-B-L-E, Bible. Yeah. How can we prepare for Jesus' coming? Let's listen to the story. God's people remembered how God had always, all through the years, been loving his children, keeping his promises to Abraham, taking care of them, forgiving them. Even when they disobeyed, even when they ran away from him, even when they thought they didn't need him, then God told his children something more. I can't stop loving you. You are my heart's treasure. But I lost you. Now I am coming back for you. I am like the sun that gently shines on you, chasing away darkness and fear and death. You will be so happy. You will be like little calves running free in an open field. I am going to send my messenger, the promised one, the one you have been waiting for, the rescuer. He is coming. So get ready! It had taken centuries for God's people to be ready, but now the time had almost come for the best part of God's plan. God himself was going to come, not to punish his people, but to rescue them. God was getting ready to wipe away every tear from every eye, and the true party was just about to begin. That was today's story. What does Advent mean? It means coming. Who is coming? Yeah, Jesus is coming. Why did Jesus, did Jesus come? Jesus came to save us. Now it's a singing time. Yay! Hi, Claude. Hi. Thanks for coming. Let's start with Jesus Loves Me. Can you sing with emotions? All right. Let's sing the emotions. One, two, three. Jesus loves me, this I know. For the Bible tells me so. Little ones to him below. They are weak, but he is strong. Yes, Jesus loves me. Yes, Jesus loves me. Yes, Jesus loves me. The Bible tells me so. Yeah. Oh, what about the my God is so big? Shall we sing that one? You can do anything with God, right? Okay, let's sing. My God is so big with the motion. Can you do that? One, two, three. My God is so big. So strong and so mighty, there's nothing my God cannot do for you. My God is so big, so strong and so mighty, there's nothing my God cannot do for you. The mountains are His, the valleys are His, the stars are His handiwork too. 
My God is so big, so strong and so mighty. There's nothing my God cannot do for you and you and you and you and you. Everybody did a great job. This week's craft is the nativity card. Here is a baby Jesus lying on some hay in the manger. You can make one and then send to your friend or family. It's time to do our closing prayer. Put your hands together, bow your head, and close your eyes. Thank you, God, for loving us so much. Please help us to show your love to others. Amen. It's already time to say goodbye. Oh. We would like to continue to share the pictures of our friends at the end of our video every week. So please send some more. Please. Thank you. And also, this year, we are doing a drive through Advent Craft Festival. There will be music and goodies and craft packets. Lots and lots and lots of fun things. So, please make sure to come. I will be there too. <laughs> I miss you all and I am looking forward to seeing you next week. Bye-bye. Annyeong. I love you.